Hello everyone and welcome! My name is Luda and the name of the game is Pillars of Eternity. Thank you for joining me. Uh, last time we killed off some ogres over here. We helped a friendly ogre who were standing around over here and wanted us to kill the rest of the ogres. The reason for that was that they were all turning cannibals and this guy was the old leader I think. And that was his wife or something. And we killed her off. Not really the most fun thing to do but we did it. Uh, and it looks like whatever it is like at the lowest level of Adnua is corrupting everything else above it because they hear voices and we saw the dragon and we saw this over here uh, being corrupted somehow. They were like, oh, the voices are telling me to kill everyone. So yeah, hopefully they won't do that to the one who are like in charge of the castle and everything like that. I do think we're actually, so we did complete level two. I think that is the one that dropped us down. We're going to take a look at that. Oh yeah, yeah, so this sacrificial pit here is the one that we did before. Uh, so we should just be able to take the stairs up and we should be heading back up to the uh, to the top because I don't really think that uh, it's gonna do us any good to go further down below. We have been struggling, we struggled mostly with level 3 basically, uh, even though we weren't down to level 5 or level 6 or something. Uh, so yeah, we're gonna go back up to the surface and we do have some castle stuff to check out. Can we go to the top of the stronghold by the... okay, no, okay, we got some here. So explorers in Air Glanf have discovered an ivory horn of disputed province. Many Glanfathans believed it was stolen from an Angwith in ruins. But the explorers claim it was dropped by an early dwarven expedition. The explorers were waiting for dire wooden arbitration. Arbitration, yeah. In Ina's rest when thieves attacked the group, killed several members and stole the horn. Its current whereabouts are suspected to be somewhere along the Isen Ian River or something. I, come on. Give me, a, give me a break with all of the pronunciations here. So Pelagina tracked the Ivory Horn Thieves all the way to Fork Vale, and after a small skirmish, two thieves were dead. Rather than die for the horn, the remaining thief dropped it and fled. Pelagina recovered it and returned it to the arbitrators at in Ina's rest. After a ruling in their favor, the remnants of the expedition gave Pelagina the Nautilus of, of Or Gramen, a wondrous enchanted shell from the dead fire archipelago. So what is this? I have no idea. <laughs> experience and money nice uh, so we did get something else here I want to criminal but now nearly the deft hand has arrived at the stronghold seeking aid in fleeing the direwood so I think that is everything that's going on we did a quest we got that and I think we are we can build something can we build that no okay I don't know I don't know why we had three notifications here but we did okay so let's go back up to the surface all right so fast mode Stop that. Let's talk to the thief, Marshal. No, that is the Marshal. Hello, Marshal. Are you near the Death Town? Let's see what the Marshal has to say for when. Uh, Seven Dharma March Jam will field now. Why won't the Earl of Vision Legacy my claim? Um, have you already read this? I don't know. Oh, no, I don't think. But let's see. Okay, so farewell. Let's talk to the thief here and see if he has anything cool to add here to Death Town. Um, begging your pardon, all my lord, but I was hoping we could talk. Very well, let's hear it. Uh, you call your allies together and motion for the petitioner to step forward. Oh, okay. Oh, that is awesome. Look at us. <laughs> Bjorn is just standing. Urgh, I'm gonna kill him if he says anything bad. So, might be I got myself nicked here and there for a few and several deeds. My name's on posters all over Defiance Bay now. Makes it harder to walk about freely if you get me. My thinking is, it's time for me to seek out new horizons. Deadfire Archipelago seems nice. Then I'm out of everyone's hair, only... I could use some help getting there. Not that I'm asking you to do this for free, mind. Uh, I picked up a couple of things here and from a fellow I know. Not much good to me if I'm caught. I can help you escape. You should turn yourself in. How dare you show me your face in my keep. So what is the thing here? I need to know before I can tell you. Okay, you should turn yourself in. Are you dare show your face in my keep? Um, so I don't know. Uh, you should turn yourself in. Let's see. You can't be serious. They will hang me. I'll see they'll give you a lenient sentence. It's better than living as an outlaw. Eyes of the Crucible positive. Okay. So, yeah. Yeah, alright. It's been hard trying to find a burrow to hide in. Might be best just to start over clean. Thanks for giving me an honest chance at it, I guess. Your stronghold has gained one prestige. Oh, okay. So that was basically just if you wanted to do stuff like this. Okay. So. Uh, near the left hand leaves the stronghold. Yes, yeah, so we just came here We told him to turn himself in and he left and he didn't even he didn't even tell us what he had stolen That might have changed our mind, but sure. Okay, let's go out of here All right, so let's actually That's go to indeed. the 
Sure, better indeed. Let's see here. So we do have through the Death's Gate, tr gate travel to Direwood Village. Uh, ruins. Are, okay, so that is the yeah, the hollow wing of the Direwood. Find a tower. We do think I do think we know what a tower is in 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 the city there. Uh, Misery Madness. Uh, and please, Misery Madness. Any find this agent discover a plan. Okay. We do have a lot of these things here. So travel with either. No, not really doing anything. Continue to get no drawn. So explore down this way with Kanarua. Kanarua. It was Kanarua. Oh, Kana. I can't I didn't uh, like Rua. Who, who is Rua? It's Kana, of course. Okay. Explore endless paths. We do have those already. Eclipse. So on a vision. See the heart of what Martin can do. That travel to the cave from Pharaoh's vision. Uh, travel to reveal mysteries, but you need to find something of India, wooden planes, Charlotte Five Seven Three Dogs in the Embassy, Find Mike when awaiting somewhere to find the bay, and help Marshall Forward raise an army at Cape Newa. Uh, so I do think actually what we're going to do is we're gonna do missing sentries, find the missing guards, because we are gonna go to the towers, and we did get our ass escaped, but hopefully or maybe we can actually do that battle now. So return to Vincent and Embassy first fires. We might do that as well since we are in in light, yeah, wherever we are. Thermal presentation sword. I haven't really found too much of that. Alright. Uh, so better indeed. So let's go to the city and let's actually go down there and... Um, what I was thinking? Oh yeah, try to fight off the, the, the raids or whatever they were and see if we can beat them this time around. So if we go to the map here. Go, 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 go everyone. Go, go, go. Okay, yeah, accept the roster. And we should go to Heritage Hill, I think. Because if I remember correctly, yeah, that, that's where we're supposed to go. Alright, so enter the tower in Heritage Hill. So that is the tower. We did remember that. We do need to go up here as well to get the guards again. Or see if we can do that. So it was either over there in Vala's Mausoleum or over there in the top there. I do think it was in the top, right? Because in there we found a child uh, who helped get out of here. From the nobleman or whatever. She was from over here or something. Valtas Manor and then it was Valtas Mausoleum. Yeah, that's right. Alright, so let's get a quick save before we go in here once again. Um, and see if we can actually beat her up this time around. Hopefully, we don't know. Alright, so she is still around. Uh, she was Lyra. We have Enthral just the cars, and yeah, we do still have those around. So let's see if we can actually do this combat this time around. There we go. Uh, okay, so let's do the clever one. So we do. We have done this so many times. Your ghost and you've been luring crucible knights to their deaths. What have you done to me? You're pushing hard and crucible. No initiates attack. Well, no, that that's not what's happening here. So let's see, Bjorn, can you go to the right, uh, either, I guess you go to the right as well, and me and Durant will try to hold them off to the left here. So I think that we're actually going to try to do our best here with this combat, um, and we are going to use a lot of spells and skills here, so use that on her. What is this one? So, swift aim, so right click for detail, so do it is, is this a passive? I don't know. Do this, uh, I guess. Do we want to try to get one, like, front started here and killed off? Let's do this, even though... Go, speak to Viola, find a missing guard, we've done that, and okay. Uh, so somehow, an Anthral Justice card got over here, in between here, but I, I don't really know how we did it, but it did. Uh, so do this, Bjorn, you can just keep that combat going. Either, could you try to knock the one who is a little bit damaged over? You try to kill that guy as much as you can, and you were just waiting for your summons there. Uh, oh, okay, he either got knocked over himself instead. So what do we have here? We have Baring at Death's Door. Uh, we can do that later, when they when somebody's down. Um, so what is this one? Can you even... Oh, okay, no. Let's do this one on this guy here, I think. No, let's do it on the guys you are fighting, actually. Uh, so we do it like that. Are you still knocked down? No, you're not knocked down. You're, okay, you're trying to knock down. Oh, that's right. This is what I did not like with this fight. We, she, is, she is doing some bad stuff to us. I thought we killed one guy, but we did not. Okay. You guys just try to beat that guy up then. And you... I'm okay with you trying to get out some more missiles. Is this one? Fires five. Let's do that. Um, oh, she is actually very low here. Maybe we can actually finish her off. He's immune to something. Can you do it again? I think she's dead, actually. Uh, so let's do this one again, then. You know that. Mm, so yeah, I think I think this might actually be... So why can't you do that? So it looks like we are actually only fighting these guys nowadays. Or nowadays, this time around. So it looks like we might actually have been... been 
victorious in our combat so far. Do we have anyone who is a little bit stronger than the others or something like that? Uh, let's just continue with this. There we go, and he's dead. That is lovely. Um, so I guess we do like this. You guys just focus that guy, and you try to shoot this guy. So we actually managed to beat this combat here. I'm a I say that, but hope, hopefully uh, this guy's not going to kill us all. That's not very helpful. Well, it is. It is very helpful indeed. Oh, where did he come from? Oh, maybe we knocked him over, and that's why I didn't notice him. I didn't, didn't really pay attention, probably. So there we go. Oh, Kana, who were you shooting at? Oh, God. Uh, so Kana shot at the side of the comrades. Their hearts grew bold. Yeah, stop, stop chanting that. Okay. So you began anything very special? No, not really. Spirit residue. Okay. Uh, let's just put everything in there. There we go. Yeah, it goes. That's good. So is this trapped? Hopefully not. No, it is. Okay. Trap is on. Good. Take that. Uh, go sneak, sneaky. See if there's anything hidden here. What is that? Displaced image. Deflection or reflex? That is awesome. We can take. We can have used that for a combat. I'm not sure. All right. So it looks like we actually managed to beat them these, this time around. But that was just awesome. So we did complete that. So we're gonna go for the tower this time around. I think. Alright, so it looks like nothing happened when we came out, so it should be of no trouble at all. So let's go down here and let's put on fast mode, because I do think that we have, like, defeat and everything that can be on our way here, right? Should be nothing that is wanted to have combat with us. I love how he's running through here, even though I'm not sure if, if there is anything in the road here, but yeah, we, we are running through here, don't, don't really care. Okay, so let's save, let's get rid of fast mode, and let's see what this is, so... Uh, the massive stone door to the tower is sealed, and it, is, and it doesn't appear to be any way of opening it. Well, let's speak to world you learned from the leading key acolyte. You hear rumbles and clanks from hidden tumblers as the door unlocks. That image is just awesome. Okay, so we're going down another, uh, or up, hopefully. we're going. It's a tower, so we shouldn't really go down to the cellars. We should be going up the tower. Um, so I think we got a, a save here, but we're just going to do that anyways again. So... Oh, okay, there's a combat. We have ghouls. So let's see. Get to the top of the tower in Heritage Hill. Let's see if we can actually do this, though. There we go. Uh, so who do we have here? We have Dar Ghouls. Uh, what is that? A skeletal wizard. Get out of here. Who do you think you are? Do this. You only go for that guy. Uh, Durons, I guess. Go for that guy. So shouldn't they be disengaging or something? I don't know. Uh, let's actually do our healing thing in this one, Holy Radiance. Should be doing damage to him, right? Oh, they're immune to that, okay. Uh, so focus down the ghoul. You guys focus down that ghoul as well. You just continue with that. Do that. Kana, how far are you in your shunting? Not too. Okay, it looks like... Oh. It looks like Eater is actually engaging this guy, so go for that guy. So the wizard knocked him over, right? So these dark ghouls, I don't know really if they're they're like extra tough compared to a ghoul probably. Is that wolf and die wolves? It's the same with dark ghouls, I guess. So we didn't actually manage to do that combat pretty easily, I'd say. Kana, come on, stop doing that. Somebody's seeing us, it looks like. Is there any enemies that I did not see? So what is that big thing in the middle there? How big is this map? It's not always oh, it's pretty big actually. There is some skeletal rogues over there, or one rogue at least. Let's see what we can get from this this thing here. So, day seven, a week of study, and we're still none the wiser about this device. Trindig remain optimistic. I don't know what I'd do without his spirit. All right, dearest mother and father, you will be pleased to hear that I've learned much already since coming to the city. There are many incredible ruins nearby, and Master Greg has allowed me to comp accompany him on a number of expeditions. I'm writing to you from inside an ancient and Gwythan tower. There's an entire district built up around it, but the locals have mostly left the tower untouched. They've l they have let us set up a temporarily living quarters here, so our work can continue uninterrupted. It is an unsettling place at times, but Master Greg has been a constant comfort, and he is quick to remind me that the things we learn from this tower may one day help us find a cure for Wademan's legacy. I'd better get some rest now. Mr. Greg likes to get up early. That's, likes to get an early start to the day. All my love, Trindig. It doesn't feel like he got to send those things though, but. So the matter is lumping in smells of old straw, but whoever slept here at least made it neatly. So we have revenants and stuff. 
Got out of combat, everyone. And just run in there and beat him up. So we have some skeletons. It feels like there's some uh, animancy going on here since uh, the necromancy is here. It's, it's basically called animancy instead of necromancy. I mean, we haven't really found out who the grog or, or not grog, what was it called? Ghouls? Nah, yeah. Well, they ba they're basically ghouls, really. Uh, we haven't really found out who could have like done them or uh, could be responsible them. For them, page from all times journal. Day two. We completed our measurements of the machine thanks to Trinity's youthful agility. Further examination is required to discover its intended use. So yeah, it feels like they they did try to like oh, let's get the wizard. Fight the wizard. Why are you in front though, Ella? No, we killed off the wizard pretty fast there. Let's just do that. You do that. Go for this guy. Skeletal fighter. Well, no, Bjorn is blocking the way. Well, we should be able to finish him up pretty quickly, right? No, it's not. It's not very helpful at all. Uh, so I, I just want to... No, keep, take everything. There we go. Uh, everyone... Because we don't really have to be sneaking to find out these kind of stuff. That's cool. I thought we had to be in sneaky mode to do that, but it looks like we're okay. We can just run by. We'll see what's in here. Uh, see what this is. Padding the scratchy old cover thickets in there with dust. No one's used this bed for weeks. Okay, so it's been a while since they were examining stuff here. So let's check it. Can we see what this is then? Can you guys just run around here and see what the hourglass says about this or what this thing here? Essence shimmers and pulsates within this strange device. It's not an hourglass. It is uh, an examination glass, I guess. Is that what it's called in English as well? That's what it's called in Swedish at least. Let's go upstairs here. Alright, so let's see. Um... Oh, a Dargle. I, I did not go into sneak mode. Oh, and we knocked him over, actually. I did not. I don't know who has the power to do that or ability to do that. For somebody of the range guys did, at least. Alright, so now we are all of a sudden... Yeah, I don't care if you disengage. Uh, Aloth, uh, you are almost dead, so get out of there. You go... F uh, you do your thingy here. You go with that. Aloth, you knock him over. Do this, do that. Okay, so either it is with the ghoul here. So is it looters over there? It is. So you just give all of the healing and then we're gonna try to disengage with Alath and get him out of there. There we go. So he died, so it doesn't really matter there. Uh, you can probably do this and these guys. You keep on fighting that guy. So the dark wolves are apparently they do quite a lot of damage at least it looks like uh, at least more than what the regular ghouls does or ghoul because they're getting getting their asses quick uh, kicked very quickly but they, they did do a beating to Alok very quickly as well actually okay, so going to sneak sneak mode uh, take whatever you can here did we did we aggro the guy who was down here I did see somebody down there. No, we do have some couple of more evidence there. Let's see if there's more like uh, notes down here. That should be something like that. Oh, major spell binding, arcane dampener of intellect. So you take that. Let's see, letter, letter from Encantha, Eidhelm. I did indeed receive your recent summons as well as the two that came before it. I've been waiting for you to pre present yourself on my doorstep so that I could give you my answers in person. And firm and unwavering, no, I won't help you. In fact, I really relish the idea of you and your team of glorified engineers sitting in that tower, sweating over the runes I've studied for years. Nothing gives me greater pleasure than knowing that my research, which you've long disparaged, disparaged in, is the missing piece in your mundane little puzzle. As you well know, it's knowledge I've always valued. I'm just around the corner. I encourage you to find me, should you wish to rehash this conversation in person. Yours truly, Kantha. Okay, so I guess we we're supposed to go look for Encanta then. Here we go. Okay, so we did like really kill the revenants like right off the bat there. Uh, so let's just pick up some bones. Let's see if there's some more notes here. Take that. Uh, day 10. Patrons grow impatient with the lack of quantifiable results. They should drag themselves out of their mansion and spend a few nights here if they think it's so easy. T 10 days on this big tower with this like pillar in the middle here? Like, are they really doing need results that quick? Or... It doesn't feel like they, if they, they knew about this tower here, it's been a long for a long, been around for a long time. It shouldn't feel like they're like rushing for results of whatever, I guess, uh, research they're doing here. It feels like they should have been giving a little bit more time here. 
Um, let's take that, another note. Day 11. Finally got out of the tower to clear our heads. Bees take the patrons. We'll finish the study on our own terms, our own time. Yes, is it? Just as I said as much to Trindig, the sky came to life with stray lightning. I said it's a good omen, but the poor lad spooked. Only cure for that is a good night's sleep. Oh, he spooked of lightning, poor guy. It doesn't have to do uh, to have to do with anything, or have to do anything with you at least. Uh, so let's just finish this floor or finish a fight. Oh, probably gonna be a fight up there. Let's just say before we go up there. Oh, this is the, actually the, the top of the tower. So maybe we should save this for next time, I think. Uh, so that is going to be it. Thank you guys for watching. If you liked the video, give it a like and subscribe. And if you didn't, give it a dislike and I'll see if I can do anything about it. But anyways, I do hope you guys will join me for next time when we try to finish uh, finish or find out what this is all about. Yeah, I hope I'll see you guys then. Bye!